haven't been on here in a really long time. I have been so busy. I just got another job. So being in being in high school with two jobs plus college applications just allowed for a stressful tailor and a stressful life. So I haven't uploaded a video in a month. And I'm very, very sorry about that. And I'm so deeply sorry. But um, I wanted to film this video today because it marks a year of me being on YouTube, which is awesome. I have 131 subscribers, which I know a lot of people probably are like, that's not a lot. But to me, that means everything because 131 people are watching my videos and putting up with me and still saying subscribe to me even though I don't upload for a month. So in honor of my first video last year being a Black Friday haul, I'm doing a Black Friday haul this year. So let's get into it. I started out my Black Friday adventures at Best Buy. I left my house at about 8 o'clock and I wasn't planning on it. But the Ellen Show went to the Best Buy near my house, so I was like, alright, I have to get there early, it's going to be crowded. So I got there at like 8.30, and it was completely packed, like completely. There was no way I was going to be able to get in, because I thought maybe just a few people were going to be there. Not a lot, like, they're not going to be there for Best Buy, they're going to be there for Ellen. It was too insane to even get doorbusters, so I just left that Best Buy, went to a different Best Buy, and no one was there. <laughs> By this time it's like 9 o'clock, no one was there. So we went to Target and just got Starbucks and people watched at Target. Then went back in line at Best Buy. I stayed in line at Best Buy for four hours to only get this. This is all I got from Best Buy and it's Just Dance 3. It was $7.99. This is not only what I got. Um, Brian bought a PS3 so I stayed in line for him with that. But that was the main reason we're getting there because that was a door buster. But then I just got this because I wanted it and it was $7.99. Best Buy was crazy. We were there in line for two hours. It took so long. And then after Best Buy, we went to Ulta, and I really, really wanted the Lorac palette, but of course, they were sold out of it. And I also wanted the Urban Decay little set that they had, but of course, they were sold out of that too, because that was a doorbuster. And I should have brought, should have probably bought the OPI set, but I didn't. But instead of Ulta, I'm not a fan of this year's holiday bags. I don't know. I don't really like them. I bought a Conair Pro Styler. Blow dryer. I, I never used a blow dryer. I never even really had one. Um, yeah, I just didn't have one. So I was like, you know what? It was ten dollars. It was originally twenty. I figured I'd buy it. Plus, with my three fifty off of ten dollar purchase, it came out to be six forty nine. So six forty nine for a blow dryer. I figured, why not? I will use one. I'll be a girl. From there, I went to the mall. Um, I was kind of annoyed at this point in time in my life. Brian also bought a bed set, a comforter, for 10, 20 bucks, I think, from Carson, so that was an awesome deal, but other than that, I went to Charlotte Russe, only got one thing, and it was a scarf for $5, and oh my god, I love this scarf. It is an infinity scarf, or a circle star scarf, whatever you want to call it, but it's really, really big and bulky, and that's what I really like about it. It's like, you can see how long one little side is, and I just like when they're bulkier compared to the thinner ones. I have a thinner one. But I just like the thick ones better. And it's just a cheetah patterned scarf. And it has like gold reflections in it and stuff. And I never had a cheetah patterned scarf. So I was excited about this. And it was only 5 bucks. I don't know if you guys knew this. But if you guys are a student and you show your student ID at Charlotte, we should get 10% off. So this only came out to $4.50. And I went to Victoria's Secret. And I didn't get the $25 hoodie because they were all out. But I got the $25 yoga pants. And I don't know if I'm going to keep them because of the yoga or the, the lugging kind. And, I don't know, I think I just kind of bought into the whole, they're $25, I'll buy them. But then I realized that in my purchase, it came with the Secret Rewards card. So, that's $10 off automatically. So, that's like $25 yoga pants again. But, these ones are just, have a pink, or a P on the side. And on the back, they say pink. And they're just like a coral color. And they're just, I don't know. I mean, I might just keep them just because they're, never have too much yoga pants. And I only have two pairs. So, maybe I will. Not sure. And then for a throwback to last year, I got the same thing I did last year as well, and that is Ralph Lauren pillows. Um, I got these last year just because they were really cheap, and then I absolutely loved them, and then I got them this year because they are really cheap, and they are my favorite pillows. And they are just like the synthetic fibers, firm support ones, and they're really nice. So I bought two of those. So now all this stuff is like Black Saturday, I don't know, I got this stuff on Saturday, not Friday. And from Paxon, I know it's still going on right now, so I'll show you guys that. Actually, do you guys want to see my Black Friday shirt first from work? I showed you guys last year, so I figured I'd show you this year as well. 
Look how embarrassing it is. Like, there's a sticker. 40% off plus an extra 20% off the entire store. Like, we had a sticker. It's so embarrassing. Alright, so from Paxson, I got these leggings. They were originally $19.50, but they were, all leggings are $10, and all body concerts, but I don't like body concerts. And they're just these cool emerald green tribal print color. And I don't know, I think they're really cool. I think I'm going to go back and get the camo ones. And, the and then on Black Friday, I went into Wet Seal. And I typically don't go into Wet Seal because they had a sign that says buy one, get one 70% off. And I was like, alright, I'll go in. And then I saw this elephant, and that, or this one shirt, and I was just like, I like that, but I'm not going to get it. Um, I'm just going to wait. So I went home, and then I like looked online to see if they were still running the sale until Saturday because I was like, I really want it. And they were sold out of it online, so I was like, okay, okay, I'll go back, I'll go back. So I went on Saturday and got it, and so instead of getting buy one, get one 70% off, I got it being buy one, get one 50% off. So the first thing I got is these scallop shorts. I've been wanting scallop shorts for so long, and I never liked the Forever 21 ones. So now I bought scallop shorts, and it's literally 20 degrees outside. But they kind of look like a skirt, I don't know. I really like these ones, and these were $22.50, but I got these half off, so they were 11 and then for what I really, really wanted, it is this cross sweater. It's so comfy. The sweater is so comfy. And it was $24.50, and this one I paid full price for, which is kind of expensive. But I knew I'd love it um, and wear it all the time. I've always loved crosses. It's always been my thing. I'm just seeing it in a sweater, and the sweater is so comfy. It was amazing. The only thing I don't like is it's not a baggy style. It's one of those like form-fitting tops. If it was oversized, it'd be awesome, but it's... Whatever, I know I'll still wear it. And that is it for my Black Friday haul. I hope you guys enjoyed. I stayed out of Bath & Body Works because the last thing I needed another candle. And I know it's not my annual sale is coming up. So I was like, don't even, don't even look at it. So I literally couldn't walk in because I knew I'd go crazy. So I will see you guys in my next video. I hope you enjoyed your Thanksgiving if you're American. Hope you also enjoyed Black Friday if you're a crazy consumer. And hope you enjoy Cyber Monday. Bye guys.